Welcome to Istanbul, a city that bridges two worlds, where the East meets the West and history blends with modern life. If you're planning a trip to Istanbul or just curious about this incredible city, you've come to the right place. In this guide, we'll explore some of the most famous and must-see sites in Istanbul. But there's more. We'll uncover the hidden stories behind each landmark, from the Hagia Sophia to the bustling Grand Bazaar. Whether you love history, architecture, or just want to discover the best places to visit, Istanbul has it all. We'll also show you some lesser-known spots, perfect for escaping the crowds, and share some fun facts that most visitors miss. By the end of this video, you'll have a complete travel plan for your Istanbul adventure, with all the key spots you shouldn't miss. So let's dive into this incredible journey through one of the world's most captivating cities. Our first stop is the majestic Hagia Sophia, an icon of Istanbul's rich history. You've probably seen its stunning dome and towering minarets in countless pictures, but do you know the incredible story behind it? Hagia Sophia was built in 537 AD as a Christian cathedral by the Byzantine Emperor Justinian. For over 1,000 years, it was the largest cathedral in the world, and its design influenced countless other churches and mosques around the globe. When the Ottomans conquered Constantinople in 1453, the Hagia Sophia was converted into a mosque. This marked a huge change as Islamic features were added, such as the beautiful minarets that now surround the building. Inside, you'll still find stunning Christian mosaics alongside Islamic calligraphy, a true symbol of the city's blend of cultures. In 1935, it became a museum, attracting millions of visitors each year. And in 2020, it once again became a mosque. The Hagia Sophia's ability to adapt over centuries shows just how important it is in Istanbul's history. As you walk through, take a moment to look up at the massive dome. It seems to float in the air thanks to the innovative architecture. Make sure to notice the mix of religious symbols that reflect the city's diverse past. This is one spot you simply can't miss when visiting Istanbul. Just across the square from Hagia, Sophia stands another of Istanbul's most famous landmarks, the Blue Mosque. Officially known as the Sultan Ahmed Mosque, this architectural masterpiece was built in the early 1600s and remains an active place of worship today. The Blue Mosque gets its name from the tens of thousands of blue tiles that line its interior walls. When the sunlight filters through the windows, the entire space glows with a serene blue light. It's one of the most beautiful mosques in the world, and its grandeur leaves a lasting impression on anyone who visits. But one feature that really stands out is the mosque's six minarets. At the time it was built, this was a bold statement because no mosque, other than the Great Mosque of Mecca, had six minarets. Legend has it that the Sultan wanted gold minarets, but due to a misunderstanding, the architect thought he said six, and so they were built. Beyond its beauty, the Blue Mosque is a living part of the city's culture. Visitors are welcome to enter, but it's important to respect the mosque's role as a place of worship. Remember to remove your shoes and dress modestly before you go inside. With its stunning tiles, intricate calligraphy and peaceful atmosphere, the Blue Mosque is another must-see on your journey through Istanbul. Now that we've seen the spiritual heart of Istanbul, let's step into the world of Ottoman royalty. Our next stop is Topkapi Palace, once home to the sultans and their courts. Topkapi Palace is much more than just a palace. It's a window into the incredible wealth and power of the Ottoman Empire. Built in the 15th century by Sultan Mehmed the Conqueror, Topkapi served as the main residence of the Ottoman sultans for almost 400 years. As you wander through the palace, you'll discover that it's not a single building, but a complex of courtyards, gardens, and pavilions. Each section of the palace has its own unique purpose. One of the most fascinating areas is the harem, where the Sultan's family and concubines lived. Only a few were allowed into this private world, 
and it's filled with luxurious rooms and stunning tilework. Topkapi also houses some of the most sacred Islamic relics, including the Prophet Muhammad's cloak and sword. These items are incredibly important to the Muslim world and are kept in a special section of the palace. People from all over come to see these priceless artifacts, making it one of the spiritual highlights of the palace. But the palace isn't just about the past, it's also a beautiful place to relax and enjoy the scenery. The palace gardens are a peaceful escape from the busy city, and from the terraces you can see sweeping views of the Bosphorus Strait. It's the perfect spot to take in the beauty of Istanbul while imagining what life was like during the height of the Ottoman Empire. Don't rush through Topkapi. There's so much to see, and every corner tells a story of Istanbul's imperial past. Ready for something completely different? Let's head to the Grand Bazaar, one of the world's oldest and largest covered markets. Stepping inside feels like stepping into a different world, a world filled with color, noise, and excitement. The Grand Bazaar has been a central part of Istanbul's trade network since it was built in the 15th century. With over 4,000 shops spread across 60 streets, you could spend hours or even days wandering through the endless maze of stalls. Whether you're looking for traditional Turkish carpets, jewelry, ceramics, or spices, you'll find it here. Bargaining is expected in the Grand Bazaar, so don't be afraid to haggle. It's all part of the experience. Start by offering about half the price and work your way up. The shopkeepers are used to it, and many enjoy the friendly back and forth. As you explore, take a moment to appreciate the history of this place. Many of the shops have been passed down through generations, with families working here for hundreds of years. The bazaar has seen empires rise and fall, yet it remains a vibrant part of daily life in Istanbul. Whether you're looking to shop or just soak in the atmosphere, the Grand Bazaar is a must-visit for anyone wanting to experience the heart and soul of Istanbul. After the bustling energy of the Grand Bazaar, it's time to slow things down and enjoy the natural beauty that surrounds Istanbul. Let's head to the Bosphorus Strait, one of the most unique geographical features in the world. He Bosphorus Strait is not just a beautiful waterway, it's a vital part of Istanbul's identity. This narrow strait separates Europe from Asia. This makes Istanbul one of the four cities which span across Europe and Asia. The other three are Ordenburg, Magnitogorsk, both located in Russia and Atyrau, located in Kazakhstan. The Bosphorus has been a key trade route for centuries, connecting the Black Sea to the Mediterranean. Controlling the Bosphorus meant controlling trade, and this made Istanbul a city of great strategic importance to empires throughout history. One of the best ways to experience the Bosphorus is by taking a boat tour. As you glide along the water, you'll see both the European and Asian sides of the city, as well as some of Istanbul's most famous landmarks, like the Dolmabahce Palace and the Rumeli Fortress. The views from the water give you a different perspective of the city, one that you won't get from land. But the Bosphorus isn't just about history. Today, it's a lively place where locals fish from the shore, ferries carry commuters across the strait, and luxury yachts glide by. If you're lucky, you might even see dolphins swimming in the waters. As you sail along the Bosphorus, keep an eye out for the Bosphorus Bridge, which connects Europe and Asia. It's a symbol of Istanbul's unique position as a bridge between two worlds, both literally and culturally. The Bosphorus is more than just a scenic spot. It's a vital part of Istanbul's past, present and future. Hidden beneath the bustling streets of Istanbul lies one of the city's most mysterious and fascinating sites, the Basilica Cistern. This massive underground reservoir was built in the 6th century to store water for the Byzantine Empire. As you step inside, the first thing you'll notice is the forest of ancient columns rising from the water. There are 336 columns in total, many of which were repurposed from older Roman buildings, adding to the cistern's unique charm. The dim lighting and the sound of water dripping from the ceiling 
create an eerie, almost otherworldly atmosphere. One of the most intriguing features of the cistern is the two Medusa heads, used as the base of two columns. No one knows exactly why they were placed here, but their presence adds a layer of mystery to this already enigmatic site. The Basilica Cistern is often overlooked by tourists, but it's a hidden gem that offers a unique glimpse into Istanbul's ancient infrastructure. It's a place where you can escape the noise of the city above and step back in time to a period when the Byzantine Empire ruled the region. If you're looking for a quieter, more unusual site in Istanbul, the Basilica Cistern is a must-see. For one of the best panoramic views of Istanbul, there's no better place than the Galata Tower. Standing nearly 70 meters tall, this iconic structure has been watching over the city since it was built by the Genoese in 1348. Originally part of the Genoese fortifications, the tower has seen Istanbul transform over the centuries. Today it's a popular tourist destination where visitors can climb to the top and enjoy a 360-degree view of the city. From the top of Galata Tower, you can see the Golden Horn, the Bosphorus Strait, and the sprawling city below. It's a great spot to take photos, especially at sunset when the city is bathed in a warm golden light. Climbing the tower is a must-do for anyone who wants to see Istanbul from a different perspective. The view is breathtaking, and it's the perfect way to wrap up your tour of this incredible city. Now that we've explored some of Istanbul's most famous sites, from the towering Hagia Sophia to the panoramic views from Galata Tower, you can see why this city is so unique. Istanbul is a city of contrasts, where ancient meets modern and where Europe meets Asia. Every corner has a story to tell, whether you're wandering through the bustling Grand Bazaar, sailing along the Bosphorus, or exploring the quiet depths of the Basilica Cistern. By visiting these must-see sites, you'll get a real sense of the city's history, culture and beauty. But remember, there's always more to discover in Istanbul, so don't be afraid to explore beyond the guidebooks and uncover the hidden gems that make this city so special. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Istanbul. We hope you're feeling inspired and ready to experience this incredible city for yourself. Safe travels.